Hey, hey, Swifties. What's up? It's Nicole. Mike, um, today's video is going to be the um, Taylor Swift Vogue May 2016 Vogue review. I'm going to show you the magazine in a second. I bought it finally today at Publix. Um, it was, um, I saw it and I was just like dead. So, um, I just want to thank you guys. I just want to thank you guys so much for 81 subscribers. Oh my god, I, I guess I, I hit 81 subscribers this morning. Must have hit 80 last night, but I I didn't notice till this morning that I had 81 subscribers. Oh my god, I'm so excited. Thank you guys so much. I appreciate all of my subscribers. I love you guys so much. Um, I would do shout outs, but I, I really... You guys know who you are. I love you all. Thank you guys so much for watching my videos and um, just giving me the courage to sit here and talk about Taylor Swift. I love you guys so much and um, you guys are just amazing and I love all of my subscribers so thank you guys. If you're new to my channel, welcome. Um, this channel basically is me sitting in front of a camera, sitting in my room, talking and fangirling about Taylor Swift. Um, so if you like Taylor, please subscribe to my channel because I'm a diehard Swifty, been a Swifty since 2006. So, um, oh my goodness. So, um, if you love Taylor Swift as much as I do, you can subscribe to my channel and check out all of my videos. So here we go. This is the, um, uh, May 2016 Vogue Taylor Swift review. Here we go. Here's the front cover of Vogue. Oh my god, Taylor is so freaking beautiful with her bleached hair. Um, now when I first saw this cover, I thought it was Carly Kloss. <laughs> I looked at it and I was like, oh my god, Carly Kloss? Uh, and Taylor posted a picture of it on her Instagram and I was like, oh my god, she's, uh, she's supporting her girl Carly. I was like, oh wow. So then I will, uh, when I looked closer, I was like, oh wait a minute, that's Taylor. That's not Carly. Um, what threw me off is that Taylor, she's not wearing any of her eye makeup, so she threw me off, and plus it says Taylor Swift right here. But I love this cover, it's so beautiful. I love this dress she's wearing. Um, I read this cover like 13, it's so freaking beautiful. So this is May 2016 of Vogue, so you can get it on newsstands news now. Um, I got it today, a lot of people got it yesterday. Um, so the article of Taylor's starts on page 1, 70, 70, 72, 73, 74, 176, it says right here, it starts, actually it starts here, May 2016, right here, there's a little page right here, and there's a tiny little photo from the photo shoot right here. There's that. Okay, so here we go. It starts right here. Full control. I read a little bit of the article, not the whole thing, because it was really long. So there's this. Full control. Um, I like this silvery dress. It's an interesting style for Taylor. Um, this picture is beautiful. This one. Right here. Beautiful. I read a little bit of the article. It's really good. She talks about um, basically, you know, her success and the um, the wedding she went to with Brittany, and I just and she just talks about you know her family. There's another um, photo from the photo shoot right here. I'm sure you guys have all seen these on Instagram. I have. I'm still trying to get used to Tyler's bleached hair. Um, you can let me know what you think about Taylor's bleach hair in the comments. Um, I'm a little, like, shocked <laughs> still that she bleached it because I'm like, wait a minute. Oh, because when I saw these, um, photo shoot, these photos from the, from this photo shoot, I thought it was a wig. I really did. I was like, she's wearing a wig. Nope. Then when I saw her photo from Coachella where her caption was beach Shella, bleach Shella, I was like, oh my god. That ain't a wig. That's Taylor. She bleached her hair. And um, it's it's hard for me to get used to it because I, I miss her um, naturally blonde hair, which used to look like mine. 
Oh, here's more pictures from the photo shoot. She's absolutely freaking beautiful. I'm not gonna lie. Like, she's a beautiful, beautiful human being. Tyler Slate. But, um, getting used to the bleached hair. It's sort of growing on me. She looks beautiful with it. I'm not gonna sit here and say, oh, she looks like... No. And this photo I love. Black and white. Taylor, close up of the black and white is so pretty. And this one right here. Then, that is it. That is all of the photo shoots. That's it. So, that is all of the photos um, from Vogue May 2016. So, if you haven't gotten your copy of this yet, you can go buy it on newsstands now. I heard it's at Target, Walmart, wherever they sell magazines where you live. Um, go get Taylor's um, May 2016 cover of Vogue. Um, but yeah, this was my 2016 Taylor Swift Vogue, um, I'll just say Taylor Swift Vogue 2000, May 2016 review, beautiful, that magazine, the article is really good, it's really long, I didn't read the whole thing, just maybe two or three pages of it, but you guys can go buy this magazine, it's on newsstands right now, I don't know when it'll be on newsstands, <coughs> till, <coughs> excuse me. Um, but yeah, you guys can go pick up your uh, May 2016 copy of Vogue with Taylor Fall Swift Queen on the front. Um, so you guys can let me know what you think of Taylor's bleached hair. Um, it's growing on me, kind of. Um, uh, when I first saw it, I was like, shocked. I was like, hope that's a wig. Nope, it's not a wig. That's Taylor's hair. But more that I look at pictures of it, it's be it's really pretty. She looks happy. So I'm not going to judge Taylor. It's really honestly just hair. Like, she hasn't changed. Her personality is still the same. She's still the same Taylor we all know and love. She's just growing up. She's 26. Like, come on, give her a break. Um, a lot of Swifties, when they found out she had bleached hair, there was a lot of drama on, on Instagram. Now it's just like, oh my god. People were upset. I wasn't upset. I was just like shocked. I was like, oh my god, bleached hair. Um, but it's a new look for her. And as you all know, Taylor, she goes through different phases of, of having like styles. So hopefully, um, but she does look beautiful and she looks happy. So I'm not going to judge her based on her hair color. That's not why I'm in this fandom. <laughs> I'm not in this fandom for her hair color. I'm in the fandom because her music is like my diary and I love her music. And I love Taylor as a person. So I love you guys so much. I hope you enjoyed my 2016 Vogue cover, review, Taylor, whatever. Um, so I love you guys so much and thank you, thank you, thank you so much for anyone's subscribers. I love you guys so much. Don't forget to be fearless, speak now, shaking off those haters. And fun fact, this video that I'm going to upload is going to be my 89th video. 89 videos. Oh my god. So happy. So I love you guys so much and um, put video requests below. And um, let me know what video you guys want me to do next after this video. So I love you guys so much. And bye, guys.